What's good, my vegans? It's your boy, the vegan Batman up in this piece. Just got finished working hard. I hope you checked out my review for Mama Rosa, my homegirl, my sister. Love her to death, my vegan sister. She had this delicious barbecue jackfruit. I told her, I saw her video. She was tearing it up, getting to eat on and everything. I told her I was going to go after work today, and I was going to go to Whole Foods and try to pick it up. Well, I went there, and unfortunately, the big, crazy, humongous Whole Foods down here in Chinatown, New York, there was none of that delicious jackfruit, barbecue jackfruit. So, anyway, I decided to get some seitan. So I got some terrazzo flavored seitan. I got a regular flavored also, but I'm just going to use this barbecue one. I mean, um, what is it? I forgot already. The, I just said what it was. Oh, the terrazzo flavored. Don't mind me, y'all. I haven't worked all day. Taking care of people. And, all right. So I got a lot of different things here. I got some guacamole, freshly made guacamole. Here's the price at the bottom. Oh, my bad. My bad, my vegans. That's the price right there. Then I got these for $2 a piece. I got some, this is delicious. Horseradish, beet, beet horseradish hummus. I've tried that many times and I love it. It's really delicious. This is going to be my first time trying this one right here. It's French lentil. What? It's not what I picked up. French lentil? Oh man, my vegans. It's hummus, so you can't go wrong with it, but I thought I was picking up... What was it? They had a whole bunch of different new names or whatever, and I was trying some different stuff. I like to, you know, it's always good to try some different things here. And then I got some. Organic, man, funny. Sea salt tortilla chips. I say organic sea salt tortilla chips. Dad, I can't even open these pieces. Oh. They really got them sealed up here. So let me see. Taste test. And, and buckle your seats, my vegans. This is going to be a long video, but I'm going to try to make it pretty interesting here. I'm going to keep it real with y'all. I'm going to put a nice heaping of. Can y'all see that? Yeah. They put a nice heaping. French lentil. It's not bad. It's not nothing to really write home about, but it's not bad. It'll work. It'll work. And the chips, the chips are all right. It's a lot of things you can do when you go vegan. You're supposed to have fun, man. We got to live life. I've been doing a lot of fresh homemade juices this week. So I decided to let my let my hair down. Ball head style. Let's taste some of this delicious guacamole. Look at this guacamole, my vegans. Look how delicious that looks. You can never go wrong with guacamole. You feel me?
Let me tell you. I like to do these videos where I eat and talk about it because this is a little secret, my vegans. This is between me and you. I used to watch people, my favorite people, and when they done different food taste testing or whatever, I used to always look at them mouth watering like you guys are right now and be like, man, man, that looks good. So, all right, we got a little bit of veganaise pesto flavor. And sometimes you got to go in, throw a little pesto on there, bat out, throw a little bit of this, whatever that lentil hummus stuff. Take some, slather some of this, I say slather some of this guacamole, this guaca. Take a little bit of this beets hummus for color. Man, funny for color. Look at that, my vegans. Now, part oh, pardon the arm, y'all. Man, where's my man? Is that? Oh, let me show you something. Also, I've been talking about pH. And I've been hearing, a lot of you have been talking about, like, you haven't been hearing about that in a while or whatever. Well, pH is important, man. 6.5 or better, up to 11, I believe, it goes. Maybe it goes to 13. Excuse me. But 6.5 and better. I really want to say, don't really go borderline. Go 7.5 and up. Well, bow. 9.5, baby, or even higher. You know, whatever kind you get, whatever it is you get, just try to get something that's really, you know, pH balance good. You welcome, buddy. You welcome. Hey, bringing me down. Oh, excuse me, my vegans. It's going to calm my whole body down. All that acid state, which, you know, I'm not acidy anyway, but. Oh. Just calms that body down, man. Just smooths it out. Just puts you where you want to be. Puts you where you're supposed to be. Back to this. Sandwich. Now, I'm going to take some of this chorizo flavored seitan. And for y'all that don't know what seitan is, seitan is a plant based meat. And just like Mama Rosa did, and for y'all that don't know who Mama Rosa is, go over there and check her out. Subscribe to the channel. Let her know that your boy, the vegan Batman, sent you over there. You feel me? Yo, she got all the good recipes. She's a chef. She's vegan. She loves the Lord. She's awesome. She has a wonderful relationship. Her husband's also bald head. I say her husband's also bald head. And he is so cool with me, man. I like that guy, man. Cool dude. And, um, all right. So you just, uh, mm. here we go, y'all. Here we go, y'all. So what's, so what's, so what's the scenario? Uh, 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 mm. Every time somebody does a taste test or eats something, you always want to look at their eyes. You always want to look at that whole little gesture going on. Phone. Excuse me, my vegans. 
Hello? Hello? Who this? Hello? Who this? <laughs> it's Vanessa. <laughs> Honey, why your voice sound all deep and everything? It's okay, honey. I don't mind your deep voice. You're still sexy. <laughs> uh, what's going on? So did you um, see the cops? Yeah, I saw the cops. And they said basically that... Um, Wait, hold on. Let me take another bite of this sandwich real quick. Oh, hold on. Mmm. Mmm. I made a delicious wrap. Yeah, I bet you did. Um, the cops said that the lady thought that I was filming her, so she was taking pictures of me. And long story short, they said, don't worry about it. I said, well, I don't want you all to um, get a report later on or something that some extra stuff happened or whatever. They said, well, you said you filmed it and everything, so don't worry about it. Go on film. So, you know, so that was just it, basically. Everything is all good. Okay. I saw the lady again, though, right after I saw the cops. And it just oh, so really? and it just so happened. I didn't, she didn't see me. But she was, like, looking in some old boxes that was sitting outside some building or whatever. I started to film her doing that. But I said, nah, let me just oh. keep it moving. I don't, want, you know, I ain't trying to start no trouble or nothing. But yeah, honey, let me call you right back because all of this was on film. You caught me in the middle of filming. Oh, my bad. Alright. It's okay. You want to say hi to my vegans out there? Hi. That's my baby. Alright, I'll call you back. Love you. Yeah, y'all. That's how it goes. My baby checking up on me. And if you didn't see that film with me going to get fan mail, minding my business, and the lady went and was, like, taking pictures of me. And it's all in the film, man. It's just crazy. Like, I was minding my business. You know how you hold a camera out in front of you, but it's facing you? And she thought I was, like, I guess, taking pictures of her. And I was filming myself. I'm not even paying attention to her nothing. Then I sit the camera down and, and go watch the video. It's crazy. But um, yeah, this this sandwich is delicious. And I just really want to give a big shout out to Mama Rosa. Raw Foodist. Check her out. She's a chef. She's awesome, like I said. Loves the Lord. Sister in Christ. Love her. Anyway. Check out her barbecue jackfruit video also. She was tearing that thing up, boy. Just like I'm tearing this one up right here. So, yeah. So, till the next time, my vegans. Holla at your boy. Love you. Bring it in for the hug. Where the hugs at, yo? I ain't hugged y'all in a while, yo. I said I ain't hugged y'all in a while. Sandwich in here and everything. I, I. Love you, guys.